Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another video. And today we are playing some Rage 2. Now, this game has just come out on Game Pass, which is why I'm playing it. Um, but I played a tiny bit last night and was actually impressed by the performance and everything of the game. So, what I want to do is I want to actually play it on the channel. Um, oh, signing in. Probably should have done this beforehand, to be honest. Um, so let's go for a easy new game because I'm not very good at these games as you guys have pointed out before. We had such plans for this world. Our earth so mercifully cleansed by the media they named Apophis. We had such plans. All thwarted by one man, Nicholas Rain. With the push of a button, our future was ended. The arcs emerged. The eco-pods came tumbling down, all premature, pouring life back into the barren lands, starting the cycle of life anew, as we had planned to do with our own species. Our plans were thwarted by the naive and arrogant masses. The cleansing of our weakened species was hindered. Our aid selfishly refused. They chose their own pitiful existence over the future of the breed. Such hubris. They thought us defeated. We let them believe us defeated. But we moved underground. We watched their petty squabbles, their meaningless turf wars, their childish attempts at order. Chaos, and we grew yeah. strong. Controller died. Our science, our expertise, all aligned, all with one sole purpose the surgical culling of the weak. Man reborn! We tear down the defenses. We take their compounds. We take the arcs. We raise their settlements and townships to the ground. Tonight marks the beginning of the cleansing. Tonight marks the rebirth of the authority! So there was something in there about the rebirth of the authority. What the hell is going on out there? Nothing good. Better gear up and move out. Uh, so we can pick either this one or this one. I'm gonna pick this guy. Yeah, grab your gear. Uh, let's take the weapons. And the wing stick. I'll secure the door. Oh. Oh, come on, Lily. That was my kill. <laughs> you gotta move a little faster, Walker. Lily, the closest thing I ever had to family. We grew up here in Vineland, raised by her drill sergeant of a mother. Me? I'm an orphan. I don't have a mother. But there's mm. plenty more where that came from. I'm telling you, this is the big one. All right. Well, let's go fucking get some. Come on. Let's do this. Whoa! Right, let's use this zip line. Oof. Not at all. It's gonna be hard to keep score. Ah, I was never much for count. Let's go. Walker, we need you in the courtyard. Now! We're on our way. We've got Lily too. Jersey's been deployed to warn you. 
Uh, pick up Feltroite cells from fallen enemies to regenerate health. Keep in mind that Feltroite cells are highly unstable though, and will dissolve if not picked up quickly enough. <coughs> Use a health infusion to gain health. Hmm. Oh. Holy shit! It took his whole head off! Ugh. So much for Ranger Jersey. He's not gonna defib out of that. Mom's gonna skin you alive messing with ranger gear. I don't think uh, this is supposed to happen. Still got a lot of jersey in it. Yeah, but it's our only shot. Oh, yeah! This is even better than I thought! Woo! Right, let's go! The wing stick is a versatile and deadly gadget that can be used in combination with your other weapons. On my way. Tap right bumper to throw wing stick. All right. Come on. There we go. Killed him. Tap to throw grenade. Oh, so I use that and then I go. Like that. Mom really tried to keep you out of that armor as long as she could. Wonder why. Getting jealous, Lily? Damn right I am. I would have been the youngest ranger to ever get sworn in if not for the. Bullshit nano-trite crap. Here we go. Crouch. Come on, come on, come on. Um... Da -da, da -da, da -da, da -da, da. Hopefully there's no copyrighted music in this. What's keeping you? Get over here! Hold on, Walker's inbound. Crowley, decorated war hero, ranger, and role model. Especially for Lily. She took me in when my parents died. <laughs> the meanest mom this orphan wildcard never asked for. Reporting for duty! Come here! That's Jersey's armor. Jersey, 
They killed him. You're brave enough to put on his armor. You're brave enough to do his job. What the fuck is that? Never seen anything so big. Makes an easy target. Can't be. He should be dead. General Cross. Hey, Cross. <laughs> <laughs> I want the first genus. Kill everything else. General Cross, the evil leader of the evil authority. Our own boogeyman. A bedtime story for naughty kids like me. I don't know if Prowley has lost it or if it's really true. You know this, though. If it is, I'm not gonna stand for it. Son of a- Stand down. That's a direct order! Watch out! Ah! Shit! Ah! Archists for experimentation, but for you, I'll make an exception for old times, Elwina. Mm -hmm. ah! oh. After all, your uselessness is what once spared my life. Wow. He is savage. Let's see if we can jump start this. Clear. Wait, wait the fuck. Fuck's sake. Oh, I was conscious. Yeah, you were. But your shiny new armor needed a jolt. This is it, then. This is all that's left? Just over 20 survivors. We're still digging out the ruins. I saw Prowley. It was General Cross. He... He killed her. He killed my mother. I don't know how. But we gotta stop them. And I'll personally wring the neck of that goddamn wrinkled bastard. I never really believed the stories. That the authority would return. Well, they did. We gotta do something about it. Mom knew what to do. The Rangers knew. Wait a minute. They kept their files, the logs. They kept them in the Presidio. The Ranger CP? You nuts. Only rangers can go in there. Look at me, Lily. <laughs> I'm the only ranger left. Holy shit. <laughs> you really are. Okay. Enter the Presidius. Presidio. Let's go. So that was a pretty intense start to a game, I'm not gonna lie. And I'm hoping it just gets more intense from here on out as well. Because this game, it looks really good. Wow, 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 wow. Um. What's this? Biometric scanner. 
I hope you got something for me in here, Browley. No. Oh. Unknown intruder. This is Presidio Security Protocol. Presidio. Rank and business. Walrat unit, Corporal Walker. I'm here to find information about uh about my about Ranger Unit Sergeant Erwina Prowley. Processing. Security protocol override. Walker, if you're seeing this message, it means we've been hit harder than ever before. I'm likely dead, and Vineland is late to ruin. It also means that you're the only living Ranger, and that the Authority is back, and they must be stopped. All these years, I kept you away from the ranks of the Rangers. As I hoped you would be spared in an attack like this. Likely targeting rangers and elders. You're my hidden weapon. Sorry I kept you in the dark. You now have full access to Vineland's primary arc and the technology Ooh. inside, the old icebox. Imagine spending hundreds of years in this thing. It was me, your parents, all the originals. Froze up like popsicles. And from here we emerged, kicking the authorities' ass. Inside the Ark is an ID accession distributor, which is my greatest gift to you. A device which augments the nanotechs in your blood and gives you, well, superhuman powers. There's no other way to put it. Enter the Ark and activate it. Now, let's see what kind of surprise you got for me here, Ghost Browley. She might be dead, but she's still calling the shots. Ooh! <clears throat> right. Uh, here we have the Ark. Please approach for security scanning. Security scanning complete. Welcome to Ark 401A. 401A. So I just stick my hand into this strange hole and hope for the best. Stick hand into strange hole. Huh. It does nothing. Oh, what's going on? Welcome to the simulation chamber. Ooh. In here, you will be able to gain proficiency in the use of your art weapons and any ID accessions. You have successfully installed ID accession dash. With the dash accession, you will be able to evade incoming threats and become harder to hit. Oh, tap dash in any direction to dodge incoming attacks. Good. Again, please. And again. Good work. A simulation will allow you to train in the use of your dash accession to evade enemy fire. Three incoming rockets. Come on, man. Come at me. Whoop, sorry. Once more. Come on, you can get me. Come on. Fire. Whoop, missed me again. Those Good. are some slow rockets, though. You have successfully completed your dash accession training. To the main hall. I have more information for you. Oh, more information. For my dead hands. Where's the oh that's the door. Hang on, is there anything back here? No. But this thing looks so cool. When it's rendered out in 3D, that looks amazing. Right. Uh, up the stairs we go. You've had your first ID accession. For you, there is more. There are many arcs still out there. Find them. Each arc contains valuable resources that will help your fight against the authority. But you can't fight them alone. You'll need help. If Lily is still alive, she will be invaluable to you. 
But there are other allies. People you may have only heard about. Around the end of the Authority Wars, a few of us in the inner circle of the Resistance initiated what came to be known as Project Death. It was designed to put an end to the Authority. Permanently. We knew it wasn't likely that they'd just disappear despite their losses. And furthermore, we knew that General Cross was in possession of technology that allowed him something akin to eternal life. Project Dagger was scrapped when Vineland closed its gates to outsiders. But a pact of sorts remained between me and the other three original Daggers. First, John Marshall of Gunner, a tough, no-nonsense old war horse who led the first fight against the Authority. He understands the importance of technology and spycraft better than anyone. His skills will help keep you off the Authority's radar. I think he'll be good to go for first, actually. Second, Lucem Hagar of Wellspring, daughter of war hero Dan Hagar. She went from guerrilla fighter to mayor of the greatest city in the wasteland. Her access to military grade vehicles will be indispensable. All vehicles is useful as well. So Lucem is for and then, vehicles. Dr. Anton Bossier, ex authority scientist turned resistance fighter. He's a genius when it comes to nanotrite technology and mutations. His skills are a cornerstone of the DACA project. And ground control. You will want to know what does that do? Your Ranger Armor CPU has logs that will be able to answer many of your questions. Cool. Good luck out there. Ranger Walker. Right, let's go. Project Dagger. Damn it. Thought you'd just dump all that on my shoulders and waltz off into oblivion, huh, Aunt Prowley? Well then, I guess it's all up to me now. Let's go. Return to Lily. <coughs> <coughs> Lily, there are three people I need to find. John Marshall, Dr. Kvasir, and Lucem Hagar. They're all part of a Project Dagger designed to stop the Authority. That's a pretty tall order. Yeah, your mother is no nonsense, even from the afterlife. Too soon, Walker. Sorry, Lily. Uh oh. But hey, I'm ready to trek out into the wasteland. I think I got just the thing. Come see me. Cack in check. Give you a gun. What's this? Look at me. Oh yeah. Right, here we go, Lily. So, what you got? Well, I've got lots of ideas for projects, and with your help, we can get them off the ground. They're gonna be key to your survival out there. So, let's get you your ride. Ooh! Welcome to the project screen. Here you're able to purchase projects using project points that you have earned. Projects give a large variety of benefits. At the moment, you only have access to Lily's basic project. The first project that you can purchase unlocks the vehicle's menu. It will also reward, uh, reward you with your very own combat vehicle, the Phoenix. Oh, nice. Hang on. Phoenix. Awesome. View upgrades. Oh. So we can pick what we want. The garage is online. Phoenix is good to go. They're more pro Gotta go. Here we go. Prowler. Right, so we got the wasteland map here. Oh! Oh, that's quite big. Uh, I think it was John Marshall we wanted to go for. Well, look at you. A fresh ranger. I'm Phoenix. I know I look good, <coughs> but I drive better. Let's you and me go for a spin. Huh? The cars talk? This is smooth, though. I love how smooth this game is, and the fact that it runs in 60 frames. Um, is absolutely stunning. I got eyeballs on a roadblock. It's man-made. I'm thinking am. 
Road choke is a trade coalition roadblocks that have been taken over. Clear the outpost. Take some rounds. Ooh. We could overdrive, but I want to save it for when it's important. Anything across here? No, nope, what just went kaboom? Oh, I wonder, do these go kaboom? Yes, they do. That's amazing. Right, uh, let's turn this. Learn the project point, go to the menu. Uh, here we go. Let's go project. Oh! It's frozen. Well. Come on. Here we go. Project. Uh, we got to meet up with... What's this? Overdrive multiplier. Uh, magazine refill. Arc projection. Oh, we'll do them in a minute. Uh, right, let's carry on. Uh, hmm. Whoa, what the hell is that? So, there's a big tower just standing here. It's got authority written all over it. Sounds like a sentry tower. Leftovers from the war. Usually they will fire at anything that comes too close, so be careful if you're gonna go for it. Walker, listen. We're still gonna meet Mayor Lucem, right? I would presume so. Oh, so you can swap weapons like that. That is good to know. I feel like the next vehicle thing that I see I should shoot at. It's a bandit post. Looks like they're hauling fuel. It's a support pit. Topping tank for convoys and raids. Destroying that fuel should put a dent in their mobility. Oh, pit stops are areas the goon squad can fill up their vehicles with stolen fuel. Destroy the all the fuel containers. Welcome to Gun Barrel. Hello. Hey, you look tough enough. You interested in some wet work? 
You know, knock some heads, shoot some 200 muties at the paste. Not looking for a job. I'm here to see John Marshall. Yeah, as it happens, he's the one looking for a skill trigger puller. We got muty problems in gum barrel, see? And we can't do shit until we've fucking rectified that. Yeah, we'll see about that. Where do I find him? He's in the Dud Primer Tavern. Always in the Dud Primer. Can't miss him. Old, scarred, mean, robo-peg, robo-peeper. Half spares, half guy, you know. And they're now. Oh, uh, whatever that false little greed about tells you, don't try the slime global Jimmy Chunga. Unless you want to puke your guts out of a thoroughfare. Sounds good. Right, so we'll find traders here, which allows us to buy stuff. Oh, what's this? Exciting excavations number one. Greetings, faithful reader. It is I, Ransack Tumbledown, collector of antiques <laughs> and rare curios. Welcome to the first of my published journals. Exciting excavations. The Wing Stick, crafted by legendary Priapho. Christopher Wing, this device was so effective it actually decapitated its creator during a test session. Did it? Um, is it in here? Hey Carter! Let's trade some word! You bash any muty heads yet? Oh later. We're in the club. <laughs> now I'm telling you, that's bad intel, Gulo. Oh, Gimme, you just need a tiny goat marsh. No, you don't get true swill if you don't give true talk. I speak the day's true marsh. Violence destroyed. Yeah, right. Blown right to shit by mega bad techniques. I ain't biting, Gulo. You're just looking for a free fix of swill here. Vineland is gone. <gasps> I was talking true. Don't plug it all at once. Ranger, huh? Oh, I haven't seen a ranger here in a long time. John Marshall, legendary resistance fighter, war hero. We grew up on stories about this guy. years old. I gotta admit, I was expecting something more impressive. He does look tough, though. Seems impossible. Vineland's defenses were impenetrable. So we all thought. We weren't ready for them. We weren't ready for the authority. They're back then. I'm guessing you'll hear about the Dagger Project. Problem is, we're under a whole different kind of siege here. Muties. They're clogging up our power turbine in the sewers. Now, if uh, someone was to take care of that... If that's what it takes to get Dagger online... Show me what to kill and where. <laughs> you catch on fast. I sent down every Renna killer who walked in here, but they all end up dead. It won't take long. Ah. Right, where we gotta go? Where do we gotta go? Where do we gotta go? We gotta go out here. Uh, right, we got to enter the sewers first of all. Where is the market? Is the market around here? I think it was when I played through it earlier. Uh, no, this doesn't look... Oh, Burger King! They got a Burger King! Here we go, this looks like a market. Trader, General. Seen your face down this way. Punchy's the name. Maybe your peeps told you about me. I got the goods you need out here, and I ain't too high and holy to deal with Vineland people. <laughs> How do you know I'm from Vineland? Ah, you got the outfit, see? I recognize the Dudlers. Uniform like that. My Rangers get them. That means you with Prowley. And that means you can deal with me. Okay, let me take a look at what you have. Come again. Cool, so you got a little bit more up Perfect time ammo. To back to gun barrel, eh? Marshall sent you, huh? Third one this week. Let's hope you got something they didn't. Hmm. The 
There's an underground stream down in these old sewers. We hooked it up to a turbine generator. Makes us completely independent. It's a long way down. As in, we got our own power supply. We don't have to buy no feltrite from greedy traders fixing the market and playing dirty. Mother Nature provides. And how's that working out for you? Well, apart from the occasional wrench in the works, like, uh, say, a beauty infestation clogging up the turbine, we're good. We got our own juice. Plus, there's always a gun for hire to do the jobs if things go south. That's what I am? A hired gun? Hell no. You're a ranger. That's a whole different enchilada. Whole lot spicier and meatier. Just making sure, Marshal. Just making sure. Ding! Right, reach the sewer turbine. What on earth is that? Here we go. Oh, that's one of the guns for hire, probably. Dead. Hey, Marshall, Wait, is that an arc? Do you know there's an arc down here? Just sitting there. Oh, yeah. Maybe you got the nanotrike config it takes. See if you can't get it to open sesame for you. 402A. Welcome to ARC 402A. What's in this one? It's an Arctech shotgun. Oh man, I've only seen these in old hollow bones. That looks cool. Oh, tutorial. The shells are melted into a slug in a high precision mode. Good. Oof. Sequence completed. Use the combat shell drive against the simulated enemies. <laughs> the amount of damage in there. Ending simulation. This is going to be mad. I hope there's lots of enemies. I want to be able to go like bang, bang, bang and just shoot them all up. Ah, the old corridor sweeper, eh? Abilities and weapons found in arcs can be upgraded. To upgrade your abilities and weapons, you can find nano trite boosters and weapon core mods in arc chests and shops. Ah! Oh, money! We need that to get that mod. Boom! Got a little bit of cash there. Cash here, dry cleaning bag.
chemical component. Let's use the assault rifle for a little bit. Oh, you walked into that, mate. That was your own fault. Oh, storage container. What's this? Feltrite. I can't get through there. Right, let's go back to the shotgun. Crazy mutant spores. I wonder what they're used for. They must have some form of use. The fuck is that? Uh, this is disgusting. I don't like this. This is disgusting. Ow, that backfired. I saw him right out the corner of my eye there. Worn flywheel. Ah, there's another supply container thing here. Oh, we got some feltrite crystals again. Ah, there's another bugger there. Move, bitch. Get out the way. What's that? Some form of vehicle on the surface. No cash. I reached the turbine. Like you said, it's gummed up with some nasty mutant goo. Yeah, you made it all the way down to Muty Central and you're still standing. Outstanding work, Ranger. Now you just need to find the lid and crack it open. Then you can flush it out. Come on! Oh my gosh! Oh, that was easy. One down, one to go. Where are they all coming from? Why are they coming from like three directions? Woo! 
Pull the lever. Okay, it's starting to unclog. What now? Once it's all flushed, close the lid. That'll reboot the turbine. Right, turn the valve. Hey, hey, we got power. Can't believe you made it. Those were some tough muties, Ranger. You cut through them like butter. I did, but now I want to get the hell out because this place stinks worse than a grunt barrack septo tank. Well, it shouldn't be too hard. There's an old service elevator down there. Where? Ah, over there. That looks like a service elevator. Why can't we take this in the first place? Just go straight into the heart. Ah, to be fair, this elevator probably wasn't Project working in the first place. Now that's one for the books. It was me, Doc Kavasir, Lucem Hagar, and your own Sergeant Prowley. You do know Sergeant Prowley. She raised me. Made me into the killing machine I am today. I figured. You have that uh, extra something about you. Like you've been trained by the meanest and the best. She didn't make it. She was killed in the attack. I'm well, sorry to hear. That explains why you're here, I guess. Filling in for Prowley. Whatever it takes to crush the authority. Amen. By the way, what's your handle? Call me Walker. Walker it is. Walker. Ranger Walker. There you are. This is my armory. My base of operations. From here I'll be able to start working on Project Dagger. Now with the juice flowing freely again, there are a few more projects I could use some help with. I bet there is. Walker, these projects come with benefits for you too. While I'm setting up Dagger, you might as well get beefed up for the grand goddamn cataclysm. Don't know if you know, but Project Dagger involves you driving a jury-rigged tank into Authority Headquarters alone, and manually distributing a nanotripe murder mickey into the grand ghoul himself, General Cross. Sounds like fun. Guess I better get busy then. Guess you better. I'll reach you on the comm box when I need you. Unlocked Marshall's project. I'm guessing that is kill and destroy. Um, twenty five percent more of each type of bullet ammunition. Let's get that. Attack on an unaware enemy. That seems good as well. Nice. You'll need every edge you can get. What's this? There it is. My little dagger puzzle piece. The scrambler. You're gonna need it if you want to get past authority ground sec. But it still needs a bunch of work. Oh, that's cool. Right, let's go up to the surface. Wait. Are you kidding me? Oh, there's a ladder there as I took the elevator for the sake of it. Hey. Gotta go. You know those nanotrites you got swimming in your bloodstream? Hmm. Gotta dash. Gotta dash. Gotta dash. Oh yeah, I gotta dash, cause I ain't got no time for you. Bitch. Um right. Here we go. Well, hey. <laughs> well, hey there. Welcome back to Punchies. Y'all come back now. 
Oh, I need some more junk. Um, hang on, what's this? So I can get either a wing stick upgrade, a health infusion upgrade, or a grenade upgrade. I might go for the wing stick upgrade. Right, so thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you did enjoy. If you did, please make sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe. And if you want to help support the channel, hit that join button. It would mean the world to me. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.